So the question today is, what is oolong tea? Perhaps you've heard of, of oolong tea, woolong tea it's sometimes called, and you're wondering what it is. Okay, you've heard of black tea, uh, you might have heard of green tea, I'm sure, you might have heard of white tea. Oolong tea is another type of tea, and they all are on a spectrum. And at one end you have black tea, and then it goes oolong, then green, then white. And this refers to the degree of oxidation that has occurred in the leaf. This is a browning process. So you have to understand that all tea comes from the same plant. All right, there are slightly different varieties of the plant, just as there are different varieties of grape and so on. But they're all the same plant, Camellia sinensis. And the difference between black, oolong, green and white tea is in the processing. And this processing, this oxidation process, is like um, the browning of an apple. If you cut an apple and you leave it open in the air, it goes brown. And if you want to stop that from happening, one way to do it is to dry it. Uh, and another way to do it is to heat it, for example, by making stewed apple. And the same thing occurs in tea. This process is, is occurring because you've, you've cut it and you've broken the cell walls and the enzymes and the sugars come together in the presence of oxygen and it's you can think of it as a rusting process. So black tea is fully oxidised. Green tea is not oxidised, although there's an hour or two in which that process occurs. White tea is not oxidised and furthermore it's plucked from the, the youngest unopened um, leaf buds. So the answer to the question is oolong tea is halfway between black and green tea, i.e. semi-oxidised tea. So I hope that answers your question. Thank you very much.